AJ Hicks, track and field. Hicks is the 2014 indoor champion in the 35 pound weight throw. The junior from Solon, Ohio was named the most valuable player for field events at the 2014 ACC Indoor Championships and helped lead the Tar Heels to a second place finish. Jamie Loeb, women's tennis. The freshman from Austin, New York won two national tournaments in the fall. She captured the singles title at the Riviera Intercollegiate Tennis Association All-America Championships in October, then followed that with the USTA ITA Indoor Intercollegiate Championship in November. Loeb is currently the top ranked singles player in the country. Sammy Joe Tracy and Brittany Copa, women's lacrosse. Tracy netted the game-winning goal on an assist from Copa to deliver Carolina's first women's lacrosse national championship. It is. It in. Sammy jo Tracy. Copa fed Tracy for the game-winner 31 seconds into the third overtime in the NCAA title game against previously unbeaten Maryland. The Tar Heels have won a national championship for the first time in women's lacrosse. Meredith Hoover, women's swimming and diving. Hoover placed eighth in the 200-meter butterfly at the 2014 NCAA Championships. That finish gave Hoover her second consecutive All-America recognition in the event. Hoover is the ACC record holder in the 200-meter butterfly. Trent Thornton, baseball. The right-hander from Charlotte took the mound as a starter in an elimination game in the College World Series last spring. Though he worked as a closer for most of his freshman campaign, Thornton delivered a gem, pitching seven innings, striking out three, and allowing only two runs. Carolina won the game, eliminating LSU 4-2. Ryan Walling, Cross Country. The junior from Cary finished sixth at the Atlantic Coast Conference Cross Country Championships, earning first team all ACC recognition in the process. Walling's finish propelled the Tar Heels to second place in the championships. The winner for Outstanding Championship Performer is... Brittany Copa. And Sammy Joe Tracy. I gotta testify, come up in the spot looking extra fly. For the day I die. Brittany Copa and Sammy Joe Tracy combined to score the game winner in the triple overtime of the Women's Lacrosse National Championship game in June. Copa scored three times in the championship match. The game winner was Tracy's lone strike of the game. Marilyn Payne for Go Heels TV joined by tonight's first two Rammy Award winners for Outstanding Championship Performance. Winners of the 2013 National Women's Lacrosse title Will you walk me through that last play, the scoring play, to win the title when you got the ball from the assist to there? What kind of was going through your mind? What did you see in terms of the goalie, and, and what did you do to score? Um, well, I was coming off the sideline, and it just worked out. The timing, and Brittany hit me, and I literally just ripped it for, as hard as I can from the farthest point possible, probably. <laughs> in terms of all of your athletic career, I would assume that that ranks n near the top, if not the very top, in terms of performances for the two of you. But will you talk to me, Brittany, about kind of what the performance that stands out to you from this current season the most is? Um, well, for this season, we are both red shirting. I tore my ACL in um, January, and Sammy Joe's just had foot surgery, so that was definitely the best moment I think <laughs> that we could ever have had. But this season, I haven't really had a good moment, but next season, I hope to have many more. And in terms of evaluating the other nominees for the championship performance there, what does it mean when you uh, not only win a national title, but then are recognized by all of your peers in the entire UNC athletic department? I think that's a huge accomplishment. Everyone who was nominated was well-deserved of it, so. Thanks both for your time. Thank, Thank you. you.